Hey everyone, it's me, Jennifer. I'm back to film another pregnancy vlog. I am so excited to share these updates with you. I was planning on doing updates every week, but it's been a few weeks since my first and only pregnancy vlog so far. Um, that was 31 weeks and now I'm 35 weeks. Not, not a lot has happened, so Basically, I just am super, super tired and a little bit of nosh, a little bit nauseous. Um, I my appetite's gone down, but I still have pretty strong cravings for you know random things like this last week it's been Slurpees, and then before that was chocolate, and then before that was ice cream. So it just they don't usually seem to last more than a week or two. So it's not like. I'm getting sick of anything. I just don't feel like it anymore. Uh, really, really tired. Like I said, just feel like no matter how much sleep I get, I cannot get enough rest. Like I don't feel rested when I wake up. I'm taking like one to two naps a day, um, but I can't get to sleep at night until after midnight, one o'clock. Ethan's waking me up about, you know, the same time, like about like eight ish, nine in the morning. I'm really getting close to how much I I didn't want to gain too much weight with this pregnancy, but I feel like I've done a lot better than the first one. I don't have, you know, hardly any swelling just when I'm getting super warm or when I'm really tired. Uh, I've been trying to keep up on my water and eating well and um, just... I don't know I just I feel like this pregnancy has been a lot easier but at the same time like I am trying to take it more easy I'm trying to just uh, relax and, and rest as much as I can sleeping wise has not been that easy so I have I have sciatic nerve issues and it just the I don't know just the last couple weeks it feels like my from like my my belly, I've been having tons and tons of Braxton Hicks contractions and they're getting stronger and stronger. And I know they're just practice contractions and I didn't really have contractions with, with Ethan so I don't know what the real contractions feel like. But these are super powerful. They, holy cow, they are just awful. It's like my hips feel like, like in the back where they're connected to my side, it feels like they're just gonna break apart. It feels like they, they're like, super sore all the time and also like this might be TMI but um like my groin area like the muscles down there are super sore too well it seems like we're getting we're getting closer and closer to baby day I like to call it so we're, we're doing what we can to be prepared we have a little bit of diapers and some clothes um left over from Ethan and, you know with this second baby it doesn't seem like oh you know it's as frantic to get everything ready but uh, we're like I'm feeling pretty good with with everything we've done so far and um, we're, we're prepping Ethan for baby brother and I still need to figure out um, I'm gonna do a baby brother present and a big brother present for when they meet just I, I think that'll be kind of not, kind of sweet and and I hope I hope he will be ex as excited to meet his baby brother as as we are if you have any tips for bringing home a sibling or help us get adjusted with a new baby then that would be great uh, um, let's show you the belly okay so this is from the front I am now in the stage where I'm wearing yoga pants and like huge shirts so excuse that but this is the belly from the front, and my belly button's totally popping out. And then from the side, you can see he's just like out. He's just like all belly. And then on the other side, he's all belly. I did, I wanted to share a few things with you. These are some things that we were taking to the hospital for a baby boy. And the first off is we. I didn't know about these when Ethan was born. These are the Aiden and Anais uh, muslin blankets. These are so cute. I couldn't pass these up. The, this is the first muslin blanket we're taking to the hospital. We're taking two just in case baby spits up or, you know, the other one gets 
dirty or peed on or you know something like that so so there's this one it's got you know little cars and it's got cute colors and then this is another one that we're taking this is the other one with the cars we saw this and this is super cute so it's a little wrinkly but I washed it so it says free hugs it's just a gray really soft onesie and then we have these little le jeggy leggings so this is the outfit so cute so those are the items that I wanted to show you thank you so so much for your support please like this video if you liked the information or if you liked it um, subscribe and comment and I will see you again in another video thank you and have a good day bye